7.05 right now in the Wyoming Spring Carnival is returning. We already saw Lauren kind of make her way onto a ride. Yeah, there. that's right. It kicks off the first of 10 days tonight. Lauren Coomer, they're live having some fun. What was that that you were just on, Lauren? I forget the name of it. I don't know if, <laughs> I'm not trying to put you on the spot. <laughs> no, 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 the fun house. Fun you know, house. I yes. used to love going on those as a kid. <laughs> yeah. And I had to I had to do it for the tease, you know, you have to get in there. And it's so exciting because people are gonna have the experience to do that tonight. The uh, festival is opening at 2 p.m. today, so very exciting for 10 days long too, and it's all in support of youth scholarships. We are joined by Krishan Martin with the Parks and Rec Department of the City of Wyoming. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thank you for having me here. So talk a little bit about the festival, what people can expect for this carnival this year. Yeah, we are thrilled to bring this back again this year. <clears throat> the Spring Carnival really is the kickoff to spring and summer events here in Wyoming Parks and Recreation. It's a wonderful opportunity for families, friends, neighbors to all come together, have a great time for a really great cause. And you know we're seeing some of those staples that we see at the at the carnival. We've got the Ferris wheel. We've got the uh, merry-go-round. Lots of fun things that people can do. But it's all in support of youth scholarships. Talk about that. Yeah, yeah. So it's it's really unique for us in Wyoming. Um, a part of the proceeds for this carnival that we do with T.J. Schmidt and Company does go back directly to Wyoming Parks and Recreation Youth Scholarships. And we just are really focused on every child having an opportunity to participate in recreation, no matter where you come from, no matter what your background is, and no matter what funds you may have. So we want every single child to have that access, and this carnival really allows us to do that. And those are classes like, you know, soccer camps, dance, art classes. What's so important about, you know, kids getting involved in things like that? Yeah, I mean, recreation really is sort of that first step that a lot of kids will have towards that social and emotional learning, that team building, you know, just the exposure that you get to different sports and activities outside of your school time. Recreation is a wonderful and easy opportunity for our, our kids to be able to experience that. And so a great opportunity to support that. And it's running for 10 days, the carnival. Um, people can come out starting today. Uh, where can they get tickets? And tell us a little bit about that ticket information. Yeah, yeah. So ticket prices vary. It's free to come out here. But if you want to ride the rides or gravity food, there's going to be a variety of different costs. Um, unlimited ride wristbands are available for $25. And we do have coupons for those. So if you want to get a few dollars off, you can grab a coupon on our Facebook page at Wyoming Parks and Rec. All right, perfect. Well, thank you so much for all that great information. It's an exciting time as the festival season kicks off here in West Michigan. For now, we'll send it back to you guys in the studio reporting live in Wyoming. Lauren Coomer, Fox 17 News. Wait, Lauren, we have one request. Is there any way you can get on the Ferris wheel right. for one of these hits? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, guys. You know, it's not moving just yet, but you may see me later go down the fun slide. Okay. So that's okay. a little teaser for you. That'll Ferris be coming up. <laughs> we look forward to it, Lauren. Good, thank Lauren, you so thanks. much. I'm glad it's not raining for her just yet. Me too. So mm -hmm. a lot of fun to be had there. All right.